NFL, right? Nope. So instead, Mr. Moon took a trip up north to play for the Edmondson Eskimos and won not one, not two, not three, but five great cups in six seasons, collecting two MVPs and a 5,000 yard season along the way. So finally, after winning on three goddamn levels in two countries, the NFL had no choice but to let QB1 in. And he made them pay for every single year, signing a then record $6 million contract. Okay, now we're all cut up. So after the NFL made him waste six years of his prime dominating an entirely different league in a whole different country, he went on to play 17 seasons, though for just under 50,000 yards, 291 touchdowns, including a 25 touchdown Pro Bowl season at 41 years old in the damn 90s, pre-player safety rules era, obviously. And fun fact, he was the first black quarterback to play for a black head coach. Shout out to Dennis Green. So to the original Iron Man and the original QB1, I want to give you your flowers while you can still smell them.